There are people that are disappointed that we don't technically have the archaeology profession in Dragonflight, but to me this is actually a lot better because it doesn't require us just to go to a dig site and dig. You can essentially collect treasures, do dailies and climbing activities to get all this stuff done. Just be aware that when you have access to these dirt piles and anything pretty much above Renown 5, you're going to get sidetracked a lot. Excellent work! Now let's... Wait, no! You're a bit too far away! Get closer! Still a bit too far away! Step closer! Don't worry! He's fast asleep! Yes! Perfect! Take the shot! Hi there! Remember! Don't feed the wildlife! Let us begin. Fair skies and strong winds, friend. Any new discoveries? Remain steadfast. Fair skies and strong winds, friend. Let us begin. Remain steadfast. Check out some of these excavation tools. So there's excavator's punch, chisel, mallet, and trowel. I actually like this one. May your days be long and your hardships few. When I reached level 70, I was only level 3 with the Dragon Skull Expedition. So I just focused on the quests that gave me Dragon Scale Expedition rep. And a lot of this junk sells for quite a lot. Maybe not those ones. Let's see. Here we go. And that is the cape that I just picked up. It's one of four choices that you can choose from. Good day, Tia. Look always to the sea. Keep the wind in your sails. At Renown 5, you get access to buried treasures. So I've just landed in a location and noticed this disturbed dirt over here. I'm going to check that out. Well, there's the usual pack that you normally see. May as well just pick that up. And to actually dig one of these things up, you'll need a shovel, which you do get one as soon as you hit the renown level. So that's what they look like in the bag. Apparently they don't stack, but they do have five charges, which is handy. You 
You can see them all around a small area, which is very similar to the dig sites that we have for archaeology. They work the same as the archaeology dig sites, where you can't loot them if you're in combat. Honor all dragons. Oh, nice. You best be prepared. Don't forget to write. Nice. Now, I think this is what you need to unlock Simri's Vault Quest next time it's up. Keep a cool head. I'll see you before you see me. Mountains to climb, vistas to see. Hey. There's nothing I can't scale. I'll see you before you see me. Keep a cool head. Yep, should have packed spare supplies. Like I always say, you've got to be prepared for anything. Keep the wind in your sails. Smooth sailing. Safe passage to you. Lord Admiral's favour, friend. Smooth sailing. Safe passage to you. Look always to the sea. Okay. There we go. A peak. That mean? Oh. Nice. that oh nice I like that okay I know I'm getting sidetracked but hey it's treasure Okay, I need to go stop getting so sidetracked. <laughs> Never gonna complete the quest otherwise. How are you? Be good. 
Watch your use. back. So I did notice some of these, ooh, flower. I did notice these rocks on another cliff in another zone ages ago. There he is. Nice. Talk to me. Off with you. Watch your back. Which not was it again? Okay. That was fun. By the way, if you want to see what quests you have to do for the Dragon Scale Expedition, all you have to do is look in your quest log. You can see there's it has its own heading, which comes in pretty handy. At the moment, I just have one outstanding weekly quest to do. Expedition Supply Kit. Don't forget to write. That's all right. Oh, okay. So I can just access this when I'm not at this NPC. Here we go. I should put that on my hotbar somewhere. Let's try there. Well, that's the one that I was wondering about earlier. That's done. Nice. Getting there. I like how you get a new quest every time you earn a new rank. Kronakai Christor! Just to make sure you don't miss out on any of the little perks that come with it. Remain vigilant. Sweeper. Magnif oh, I can't choose between the magnifying glass and the sweeper, but I guess you can purchase it. Okay. I think I'll have to go with the magnifying glass. Be kind to those less fortunate. Warm Let's wishes to check. you. So, yep, yeah, you can purchase it if you want to after that. You need three tufts of primal wool to make the sweeper. That makes sense. What's this one? You need ore for the excavator. Resilient leather for the punch, which looks like that. Again, leather for the mallet, which looks like that. And the chisel. So what do you think of this early preview, guys? 
since I'm currently at Renown 7, there's still a long way to go until I have a lot more perks and a lot more of the quality of life changes. But let me know if this is one faction you're looking forward to. I know that out of the four, this is the one that I was most interested in because of the Explorers League and Reliquary. So let me know which rewards you're most looking forward to. As usual, thanks for watching and I'll see you for the next video.